This video is brought to you by XR Hammer Gaming. Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, XR Hammer, and it's just going to be a quick video today. I've got a little quest to do here to um, progress to the next area. I'm not sure what enemy it is I need to kill, but yeah, what the video was going to be about. Oh, I don't have to kill anything. Look at that. Even better. I found some blast weed on the floor. Pretty standard, if you ask me. But I found. I carried on with the storyline a little bit, and um, I found a new boss. Not boss, you know, a red chest guardian. Let's start calling them that. Red chest guardians, that sounds pretty good to me. And yeah, I found a new one. This thing is just, honestly, it's out of this world. Look at it, the king of corrosion. Like, yeah, I'm not even going to try and attempt it. I'm really not. I love it, but at level 101? I'm level 15, yeah, he can just stay where he is. All of those <laughs> random NPCs down there could try and kill him. But, yeah, this thing, I'm not going to lie, it's called the Scarlet Eye Hornet. To kill off these uh, gusty wasps. But, yeah, there's a new one-handed sword in this chest. And I'm not going to lie to you guys, I might stop and try and take a, um, oh, hello, a quick screenshot if I'm honest with you um how did I get rid of this I can't remember you know honestly I cannot remember is it that that side there we go look at that let's see if I can just creep around here zoom in and I'll take a nice screenshot of my Kirito and that boss just there look at that hey he's even Posing for me. Oh, he's got a bit closer. Look at that guy. Oh, wow, well, he's like flying around. But anyway, you get the gist. You know, I need a screenshot every now and again. Normally, I try and take them before, but I couldn't this time. But yeah, I really, really want to start farming this new one handed sword just to see if it's going to be good. So, what we need to do is they need to use their skills. And we. Oh, we stunned him. Let's whack him with a deadly sin. Oh, let me, uh, ah, no, he hit me. Come on, guys, attack. I need to try and, ah, oh, look. Considering this is, like, a level 23 red chest guardian, he's not that strong. Yeah, it's a bit upsetting. But, yeah, it's this chest, guys. Hopefully, I'll pull a really good one. I got a two-star one, but this is it. It's called the Sword of the Horizon. And look at the HP it gives you. I mean, the attack is nowhere near the sword I've currently got equipped. But, oh, bare legs. But, guys, look at that. The HP increase and the SP. I mean, that really is crazy. Like, yeah, I lose 162 damage per second through the 29 attack, but... If I can level it up or even get the five star one, I mean, that is going to be insane. Like, actually insane. Uh, yeah, that was really all I wanted to show you guys because it takes, as you can see, a long time to get here because I have to spawn in either at the bottom of the map down there, that um, Safina Strum Gorge. I think I pronounced that right. Or, as you can see, just up on the left-hand side of the map, about halfway, there's those blue dotted lines. It's, um, let's order my people to attack that one. Go on, guys. You go and slaughter it. Go on. Core attack. You guys mess it up. Yes, look at that. My people are on point. Good job. Switch. Wow, that was beautiful, but I completely missed. Yeah, look, when they kill it, I'll oh, good job them. But yeah, as you can see, it really is a long way to walk. Like, it takes forever walking in this game. So, I just thought I'd start it while I'm here. And I mean, that thing is just ridiculously out of this world. I think I'd, it hit me once, and that'd be it. It'd be game over. Just full game over. You stop what you are doing, Mr. Wildwood. It's quite a cool name, if I'm honest with you. Wildwood. 
How did he manage to hit me? He weren't even targeted on me. A little weird there. But, yeah, this is where I... I think this is where I need to be headed. Not right now, obviously, as the game's ever so elegantly told me. Where do I actually need to be going from here? Let's have a look. Because if it's relatively close... Um, well, my quest marker is kind of gone. Um, yeah, that, guys, is really unhelpful. And I mean unhelpful in the best of terms, because it says I need to kill a dragon. I needed to find that weed, and I need a dragon tail. Or something, maybe a dragon tooth, or a dragon claw. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but either way, I need to kill a dragon, and I have not come across a dragon. So what I'm actually going to do is I'll teleport back to here and see if the quest point is inside, maybe, because I mean it might well be. If it is, then I might just make this video a little bit longer, and we'll carry on. And as you can see, no, it definitely is not. But there is a red chest up there, as you can see on the map, but it won't let me get to it, which sucks. But I'm assuming that is the other way in, if you get me, from like the main map. It looks like that could be the way in from here. Like I do a little run through the path and I'll come out. I'm, I don't know. I really don't know. But my quest point has gone. It's just like straight up disappeared. It's like, no. We don't want you to know exactly where you need to go. Which sucks. But. I'm up for the challenge. I am definitely up for the challenge. But it's going to be a long challenge. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Because I genuinely have no idea where I need to go. Um, yeah. I'll tell you what. Where we ended up getting this quest from. Which was just around the... Um, corner as kind of round a corner what I'll do is I'll go and give matey boy the um, gunpowder and see if he knows or will give me the location of the uh, dragon much to my dislike because dragons are meant to be almighty all powerful beings you know uh, everybody knows what a dragon is and if I'm honest with you I don't Fancy trying to fight dragons. And this, guys, this is silly. Like, I'm level... There, level 9. I'm level 15, right? And I'm gaining 1 XP. 1 XP. This is the downside to farming. Really early on. As, like, I couldn't stress enough in my previous video about farming. Which, I'm still going to hold true to that because... I believe farming, on RPGs, farming is everything. Farming is like, it's right up the top of the Holy Grail handbook. And that was a bit weird and trippy. But, yeah, this is the downside. You end up farming way too much. And then... Ah, oh, I was trying to steal that kill. Yeah, and then everything ends up becoming just too easy for you to kill. And too low a level. So you can just, oh, he blocked that. Like that, look. I gained... 1 XP. 1 XP. What am I meant to do with 1 XP when I need like 1200 XP to level up? Exactly, guys. Not a lot. That'd mean I'd have to kill like 1200 enemies. Singularly. But anyway. Here is the NPC who gave me the quest. And he's not going to even talk to me. But, or do I have to sheath my weapon? You can find Blastweed in the gully just outside of the entrance to the mine. The dragon is to the west of the mine and has a dragon's talent I need. To the west of the mine? What mine? I'm confused. It's in the gully just outside of the entrance to the mine. Alright, but... Uh, 
See, I may have just ran all the way back here. And um Yeah, I might not have needed to, guys. But if I'm honest with you, that's for mine, but I can't go unless it was just down there. Did I I may, may, may well have just completely ran past where I needed to be. Which is beautiful. I knew I should have stopped recording after I killed that boss, because now I just made myself look like a bit of a plank. Hmm. Yeah. Well. What I'm going to do, so because if it's all the way up there, I mean, yeah, I'm not going to record all of this, guys. Me running back there. I shall just, um, I don't know. Hopefully, depending on how big this dragon is. I mean, ugh, pack it in, death bat. Um, oh, hello. He was pushing his luck. Good job. See, I've got this set on Letha as well. But I don't know how to change it to Asana. Which is fantastic. Apart from I want to be uh, raising Asana's friendship. So yeah, bit of a conundrum there. But anyway guys, I'm going to leave the video off here as I've got a lot of running to do. And that would just be boring for you lot to watch. I'm not going to lie. So, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the video. And I shall definitely be getting some more footage on farming the... I'm going to start calling them Red Chest Guardians. Yeah, that's going to be the name. Red Chest Guardians. I shall be farming him and farming that chest for definite. Because I really want a five-star version of that sword just to see if it's any good. But, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the video. And I shall see you all in the next one. Peace out, guys.